The Sharapoyezd, from Russian, ball-bearing train, was a unique Soviet experimental high-speed rail system conceptualized in 1924 by engineer Nikolai Yarmolchuk. Dissatisfied with the limitations of traditional flanged rail wheels, Yarmolchuk proposed a radical alternative, a monorail system, where carriages would move inside a concave concrete trough using large spherical wheels powered by electric motors. This design aimed to reduce friction, increase speed, and improve stability through gyroscopic effects. In 1929, after years of development and study at the Moscow Higher Technical School, Yarmolchuk secured state interest. The Bureau for Experimental High-Speed Transport was established. A 1 by 5 scale wooden test track was built near the Severyanin railway station. By 1932, the first prototype carriage, 6 meters long, with 1 meter spherical wheels, was tested successfully at speeds up to 70 kilometers per hour, later carrying both passengers and cargo. The train leaned automatically into curves, mimicking bicycle dynamics. Plans for full-scale trains included medium and regular variants, with projected speeds of 180 to 300 kilometers per hour. In 1933, the Soviet government approved a test route from Izmailovo to Noginsk. However, construction complexities, snow accumulation in the trough, difficulties with track switching mechanisms, and high costs halted the project by 1934. The system was officially canceled in 1937. Though the Sharapoy has never reached full implementation, its concepts, aerodynamics, electric motors in wheels, modular track construction, were decades ahead. Yarmolchuk continued to advocate for the system into the 1950s, including presenting a model at the 6th World Festival of Youth and Students, but gained no further support. He died in 1979, with the patent for his invention having been granted only after the project's abandonment. Today, only archival footage and fragments remain, marking the Sharapoyezd as a remarkable but unrealized milestone in railway innovation.